So, as I was saying, crazy day, Friday 22nd, and Harry, where are you Harry? Here he is, has very kindly stolen, poached a, well, what he thinks are a couple of toys from, I think, a vole's nest. So, there you go, these two little guys, Harry in the background. I'm not sure if there's a nest in here somewhere. In round our yucca or whatever. But he's poached these two little vol babies. So unfortunately, they're so small. Their eyes aren't even open yet. But they are alive and well. Um, I have no idea where they're, where they're family or where they're is from, I found one up here and one down the bottom of the garden so I think a phone call to the RSPCA to see if I can find out where these guys can go to Harry's looking at something so can't see anything Harry these two are not yours. Hmm. So, it's going to be a case of me to grab Harry. To get Harry because he's trying to, I presume, find the rest of the family of voles. So, let's throw and these two are very much alive, but they're so young, their eyes aren't even open yet. I'm gonna see if I can get to an animal sanctuary. So I'm in the car. I'm gonna try and get these two little fellas. Oh, don't know if you can see. These two little guys to the animal sanctuary. Hopefully, they're kind of snug together now. So hopefully, Harry hasn't done any damage to these guys. They are moving and breathing and they're very cute. <laughs> so. Fingers crossed can save him. Harry's also um, now in the house aware because I got a feeling if he knows where the family is, he may go for the rest of them. So let's drive to the RSPCA and see if I can drop these guys off. I believe they're not taking connections, but I can't let these guys uh, just perish in the elements. They've got to have a fighting chance. So here we are, guys. Um, we are at we are at uh, RSPCA, frankly, so it's COVID, so they did say they can't bring any animals in, but to be honest, I can't take care of these guys. Uh, they're still very much alive and kicking, and um, as cute as they are, I don't think they'll survive with me as much as I'd like to try. So let's look at them, hopefully, and hopefully they'll um, survive their ordeal. So here they both are. What should we call them? I reckon, oh, I reckon the left should be Brian and right should be Jeremy, providing the both boys. So, so get a better look. Oh, there we go. So, the guys are still with me, these little fellas, Brian and Jeremy. Um, and basically, I've got to wait for a phone call from the RSPCA. Um, hopefully they'll come out to the car, collect these guys off me, and uh, look after them. They have got a little bit more active. They look like they're not injured, so fingers crossed they can be looked after. And uh, be the, the voles that they should be. Keep you updated. Guys, see you later. Take care. So that's it, guys. Little Brian and little Jeremy, um, collected by the lovely nurse from the RSPCA. Uh, they've said that the, those little guys are going to go straight to a rehab centre um, with all the other mice and rodents and so forth. Um, but 
they basically said they don't look, look to be anything wrong with them as such. I think I uh, managed to save them before. Our oh, little predator Harry uh, done some real damage, but cute little things. I mean, wish I could take care of them, um, but they're in good hands now. And uh, that's just the start of the wildlife in the garden. As you probably saw on some of the, uh, the iPhone uh, garden test video, we have a lot of wildlife. Um, and there is one thing burying a massive hole in our garden at the moment. So let's go back to the house. I'll show you that before I end the video. I hope you enjoyed it. So back in the garden. And as I said, it's a bit more of a wildlife hunt. Does anybody know what has probably caused this? So whatever it has has managed to pull out all of the roots from these plants. We suspect badgers. But You can tell me, we do have a big wild woods behind us, but some that's strong enough to pull all the roots from the plants. Uh, any ideas? It's a crazy day, but I um, wanted to share that with you guys. The rescue of, I think they're voles. Um, and also, if anybody can work out the mystery of what's been digging in our garden, um, pulled all the roots out and started burying. So, we know there is a bad effect behind us somewhere up in these, these woods but is it badgers foxes i don't know you guys tell us if you like the video subscribe like uh, and comment thanks see ya